What's next, Pixels? I got some Ark Survival Evolved news for you guys. Now, this was kind of in like the tech tier update, but I didn't really talk about it because I want to make a separate video about it. But I'm pretty much going to tell you guys what we know so far. It's not a lot, but I'm going to let you guys know what I'm going to do when I get the update. So, pretty much you can build a base underwater. And at first, I was thinking like <laughs> that would be kind of cool, but then it is some problems with that. Like you can't really breathe underwater unless you have, I guess, these tech tear suits or, you know, have an oxygen tank. That's the only way you can actually breathe for a very long time in art. Um, but they said if the water base is two ways you can technically live underwater. The first way is build your base underwater, which is going to be hard if you already doing this with no like gear or anything like that. You can build it. And if it's closed off, then you can actually breathe inside your base. But when the doors are open, then you kind of got to breathe. So you don't want to, if you're going to do this, don't build too low. Just build to the part where you can just easily hide shit in there if you got like a secret, like a secret base to hide your stuff. Like keep it low to the ground, only you know where it's at. Go get your stuff and get out because you're mostly going to die before you reach the surface. They say you can make airlocks. So pretty much an airlock is um, you go in it first and then I guess you can actually breathe and then you go into the other room and doing it. So I don't know how they're going to do it. I'm going to have to figure it out. But that's probably the way I'm going to do it because... I feel like that's the safest way of getting stuff in and out without us dying and then we losing it when our body's floating in the water and we can't get it. So I think that's probably the smartest way of doing it. Um, I, heard, I did hear that this is like in gear stuff, so you can't really, I mean, yeah, like I said, you can do it if you get like a, like a scuba suit or whatever, but the smart way of doing it is just grind out until you get the tech tier and then do it because it would be a lot easier that way. Um, but yeah, I'm going to probably build a base. I think what me and JB is probably going to do is try to use the Xbox One actually, you know, craft the, you know, the scuba, de the scuba gear and stuff like that and just try to find what items we can get underwater because I think, I think you can get different elements underneath the water and stuff like that. So it is kind of good and this is needed in the game. So I'm going to try to, you know, explore the ocean a lot more to get used to it before I actually start building the base because Honestly, I'm be complete. I don't. I don't even try to get in the um, water at all. Mostly in art, just because of the piranhas and stuff. So, uh, I'm. I'm pretty much sure I can get some gear up real quick and just swim around and see, you know, how big or how deep I can actually go with scuba gear. And then I'm guessing with the tech tier, I can go even deeper, so I can actually, you know, find a good place. Because we're gonna probably hide this. We're we're thinking about going to a PVP server. Um, uh, if we do it on the PS4 or Xbox One, we think about going there because I think it's a lot more fun. Um, I do want to find a server where it's like really no rules at all because I'm gonna let you guys know I'm gonna <laughs> probably try to dominate that server so uh, I don't want anything stopping me trying to like take over people's bases and stuff like that so yeah that's pretty much it that's a quick video to let you guys know that you you can finally make underwater bases um, like I said I think it's pretty cool and if you look at this picture real quick I think the tech tier is not limited to just you and the dinos, I think you can actually use it for underwater fish and stuff like that. So it's kind of cool. I hope that every animal gets some tech tier gear because, yeah, man, it's about to be all out war and PvP. And I just want to be there because I, I can see it now being very horrible. All right, guys, thanks for watching me. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.